let's look at enhancement uh, section in google search console so this is basically the schemas what we apply to our websites so there are a lot of schemas which we can you know apply to our websites so whichever google detects all those schemas will come here okay if at all you have not applied any schema none of these options will be showing to you this enhancement section completely will not show to you in your search console if at all you are newly added site to the google search console and you don't have any uh, schema supply on to your website none of them shows okay you need to wait for some time if at all you have applied any schemas on your website okay so here this shows breadcrumbs okay so there are some pages where it has detected breadcrumb schemas okay so let's look at those pages over here okay so these are some of the pages it has detected the breadcrumb schemas okay so basically breadcrumb is the navigation part okay when you come like from home page there will be another sub page which is like a category or a label right for example if you look at here example.com books and inside that you have uh, an article so that is basically a hierarchy like this books science fiction award winners so this is basically called as breadcrumb this helps navigate you know uh, to the right article you know based on you know topics you categorize your website into topics for example if you look at here you know there are uh, navigations over here so some are categorized into this one so you click on this again from there you go to the actual article so that way breadcrumbs uh, are by default since this is a wordpress website by default they will be enabled in wordpress so it is directly coming here if at all your website is not made of wordpress and it's a custom made your developer will know how to do that you need to just give him this url you, you come to google search console developers one and you will find this one okay and you give this link he will analyze everything over here and he know how to code it he will do it for you okay and the next one is faq schema so faq schema is which is like basically faqs you know faqs right frequently asked questions so these kind of questions will be added uh, in at the bottom of the articles usually because after reading an article you will have lot of questions also so these are faq schemas this can be found on google whenever you search for example i just typed faq schema and there is this article from rank mart okay you see this right this is this these are called as faq schemas they have applied faq schemas for example on wordpress you can use rank math plugin this is a rank math plugin or yoast seo plugin uh, there are seo plugins where you can use them uh, to create you know faq schemas automatically you will have a option to create faq schema and you put a question over here and put the answer for it so uh, google will automatically detect it okay so whenever those pages are detected which contain faq schema those will be showing here okay for example let me go to this page okay whichever uh, you know schema is created on this page so if you come to the bottom so you see these ones so these are having faq schemas applied in the back end okay so whenever you search for uh, this page so you will see faq schemas like this and next one is site link search box in one of our pages it has detected site link search box schema okay so whenever when you search for a particular brand you will see a small search box coming in the google search result which is called as site link search box okay you, when you type youtube on google or when you type flipkart on google you will see this search box coming up so this has been detected in this site okay and you will see here thank you if you like this video please subscribe to our channel for more content like this and share this video to your friends so it reaches to more people